talk about an instant impact coming on and seconds later scoring the first of our goals this afternoon. Tell us, talk us through that. Yeah, um, Batman to the rescue. <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, yeah, I know. Like, obviously, we didn't play well first half. Um, not to like the capabilities that we got like, within the squad. Um, I think McGaffer probably said a few harsh words at half time to uh, get the boys back up. And even second half, we didn't we didn't particularly start right um, up until probably the red card. Um, is when the tyre sort of like switched a little bit. Um, but now just for me personally, just come on and try and help the side and luckily obviously I did that. It must be a striker's dream to come on when the defence is depleted like that mm -hmm. and they're down to 10 men. Did you think that this is my opportunity to make a real difference? Yeah, I think, like I said, when any side sort of goes down to 10 men, I think you've got to put your foot on the gas. You know, like use the ball well, get it out wide, get it in the box. Um, but like I said, I knew kind of when I was getting ready to sort of, sort of come on, I could see the gaps on the pitch. It was just a case of getting on and kind of doing the job and sort of like first minute, just getting in front of goal and, and putting the ball away. So look, I've, I've made um, made an impact, but um, yeah, I'm just glad we got through to the next one. And with the goal, was it your second touch? Was it? Can we claim it's your second touch <laughs> after coming on and scoring? Yeah, yeah, um, just a good touch and finish, the striker's finished. So um, yeah, like really pleased, but just through to the next round now. And then of course as well, you managed to score the winning penalty. That must have been a brilliant feeling. <laughs> yeah, I was, um, yeah, it's just one of them, I was hoping Kobe had finished it yeah, off, yeah. but in circumstances, no, I just put the ball in, just do what I'm used to, scoring goals. So um, but yeah, no, I look, just look forward to playing, uh, playing the next round now. Talk us through the situation in penalties, because obviously everyone dreads it. Some thrive on it when, they, when you're watching it, but for a player, it must be, hard to make that walk up to the spot mm. and, and know, especially when it's the potential winning penalty. Yeah. So talk us through what kind of goes through your head when you're making that walk. I think um, penalties is a little bit of luck. You know, you just got to believe in yourself though. Go, go up to the spot, know where you're putting the ball. Don't change your mind. As soon as you change your mind, you miss and then you go back like you've, after walking back and you think, oh, I should have put it that side. So pick your spot, hit it as hard as you can or whether you want to walk up and pass it in, whatever your style of penalty is. Um, but yeah, I think like I said, you've got to back yourself in penalties and uh, we've done that today. Another big cup tie on Wednesday, so it must be great to get a bit of a confidence boost in the dressing room before that. <laughs> yeah, um, we know, like I said, we know the standards we set and we know we know how well we can play as a team. Um, like I said, no one expected us to draw obviously against Stockport at home, so um, I think now we've just got to make sure we go and, go and do a job on TV and show everyone like, what we're capable of.